Freya! Open the door! We need your help! Woman, do you hear me? It is urgent! I'm still a god! Go away! The boy has fallen ill! Freya! He is ill. Inside. Burning like a fever. This is no ordinary illness. The boy's true nature, your true nature, fights within him. I did this to him. Will you help me? Not intentionally, but you did. Of course. See, that's the anguish you can see in Kratos' face. Ingredient found only in Helheim. The keeper that protects the Bridge of the Damned. I need its heart. The realm of the dead. Do you know it? Well, this one. It is a land. Not the same as um, Valhalla. Fires cannot burn there, and no magic in all the nine realms can create a blaze. As for the dead, your frost axe will be useless. You'll need so we need. <laughs> Thank you very much, Pimsy. Uh, looking good, Bay. Make me dab. Sure, we'll dab on this this part of the game that clearly doesn't doesn't. Like have it be appropriate, but sure, why not? Doesn't matter. This boy is not your past; he is your son, and he needs his father. This rune opens the bridge to Helheim. When you are there, do not, under any circumstances, cross the bridge of the damned. There is no road back. Understand? Boy. Himmel, you must hurry. Through my garden, there's a path leading to my boat. Take it. Return home. Dig up your past. Do whatever you need to do. Just bring me back the bridge keeper's heart. And your son may survive. No. May. What a guarantee. Also, I realize the game does have you do fighting without Atreus because of the whole bridge keeper fight. Right. So, totally forgot about that. When last we spoke, I was... No. You were right to distrust the word of a god. No need to explain. Not to me, not for that. I will keep him safe. That's a mother's promise. Thank you very much for that. There are other secrets you know that you don't tell us about. Just to put that out there. Alright, well, out the door we go. Use Freya's boat to return home. Helheim of all places. You all right, brother? I will do what I must. Leave me be. And we enter... Pathetic Fallacy! And we have a, a little bit of a quiet moment of Kratos contemplating what he needs to do to help save his son and what that means in terms of his past. So I never played... God of War 1 to 3 or God of War Ascension. So this kind of goes over my head. I can kind of infer the importance of it. Um, but it's not quite the same as if, you know, you've grown up with the franchise, you've played every single game uh, that was available. Uh, because it involves a character that is not introduced in this game and has no relation to any of the other characters in this game in particular. So me being like uh, playing this on God of War uh, as a first entry into the franchise is a little bit weird. Uh, hearing you upstairs and then hearing you on streams like lightning and then the thunder. I guess so, yeah. That's not bad. Hello, person that we've never met before. You have come to haunt us as a ghost of Kratos' past. We will do what we must. Mm-hmm. I wonder what gave Kratos the scar above his eye. Ja that surely is explained in a game. Nope, she's still there. Just staring at us. And she goes. Yes, thank you, Fall Guys. See, you can already tell Fall Guys 
seasons season three update has now been downloaded into downloads. Bye, Pimsy. Thanks for dropping by. Uh, I'm sure you will join for a stream sometime in the near future. <sighs> yeah, so just to sort of reinforce how much of a time difference there is between me playing this and when you guys will see it. Uh, this is after the Nintendo Indie World Showcase. And Among Us has just been announced for the Nintendo Switch. Uh, and that actually seems like it'd be a fun time. Um, it's going to be interesting to see how the controls translate from a console version to the PC version and vice versa. But I guess in theory the Switch has a touchscreen so you could potentially play it like the mobile version. Um, yeah, no, I just it's like it's an interesting thing. Um, and yes, clearly there is a lot of downtime during this particular moment. It's like there's only so much you can comment on. The sky is red. Kratos is dealing with his inner turmoil and the fact that he caused this problem for his son. And it's like, well, Mimi again is being quiet. So, yeah. Let's go, let's go, let's go. This is the urgency I would have expected when he was carrying Atreus before. Uh, we'll just skip you, I think. Oh, can I not just go inside? Oh, I can't just go inside. All right. Da, 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 da. Can I stun you, please? There we go. Thank you. I just have to fight through a horde of enemies before I'm allowed into my house. Done. Land him on the ground. Done one. I'm going to save the Spartan Rage for the bit that I know is coming up in a little bit. Next on you. These guys are only level 2 and level 3 and they already feel so weak compared to where I am in the game. Although I do kind of wish that I didn't have to chase after them after every single hit. Maybe I'll just stick to R1. Grab this one. Mm -hmm. Like, these guys don't really pose much of a challenge. Do, 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 do. There we go. Is that all of them? I think that's all of them. Okay. Let's go inside. Dig up our pass. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm looking at the axe pommel. And that's like, that is so much different to the one I've got currently. It's a cool pommel and it works out really well, but the thing that I've got on at the moment is technically better. So. But I won't. Interestingly, though, I don't change the armor set because the armor set is really good. Like the the, the stats it gives and the sockets available and the, the you know being able to switch out what enchantments you've got actually makes it decent and worth keeping until you do all the Muspelheim trials and. Uh, Get better equipment there. Yeah, there we go. We've got the Blades of Chaos, like Kratos' signature weapon, which is what lets us go through Helheim. as much distance between you and the truth as you want it changes nothing pretend to be everything you are not teacher husband 
father. But there is one unavoidable truth you will never escape. <laughs> you cannot change. You will always be a monster. When Athena says father there, is she implying that Kratos isn't but actually a traitor's dad? Monster no longer. Alright. Now let's go and head to Spartan Rage and not use the Blaze of Chaos at all. Wow, I managed to get through quite a lot of them without having to use the Blaze of Chaos. I have to say, out of the Blades of Chaos and the Frost Act, or the Leviathan Axe, I really don't like the Blades of Chaos that much. I mean, I can understand it's got way more range than the, the Axe does, but it's like, the Axe just feels better for some reason, and I'm not sure why. I think it's... I don't know. It's just... I think it's the idea of the, the Axe being something you can throw and recall to yourself, whereas... It doesn't work quite the same way with Blaze of Chaos. Would you like to die, please? Thank you. All of them. Okay. I believe I see a door to the realm between realms over there in your own front yard, no less. Take the shortcut back to the realm, travel temple, then on to Helheim, yeah? Oh, there's an artifact there. I don't know if I've actually necessarily got that in my uh, current up-to-date version of the game. Hmm. Okay, well. Alright, well, let's go back to Thir's Temple. Okay, so we need to go to Brock Shop. Yeah, still the only place we can go. Oh, dear. Yep. Uh, it gets a lot easier traveling around all the different places. Well, I'm pretty sure you weren't talking to me back there. Anything you'd like to get off your chest, brother? No. I can assure you I'm unsurpassed in keeping confidences. Still no. Well, you know where to find me. And for the record... Do I? I'd already guessed you were Greek. Athena, dead giveaway. Like, obviously... In this game, Atreus says, Kratos, you know how to speak our tongue, right? Does he have a Greek accent? It's hard to tell because obviously the voice acting being done doesn't make much of a, a, a deal about it. But I guess in universe, the characters would be able to tell. Maybe not Atreus, of course. I don't know, it's weird. Maybe they'll just speak with kind of Americanized accents. Of foreign magic. Sweet Nana's nethers. What are those? I've never seen the like. That's got to be a family heirloom. No. Nor will it ever be. Son, my brother and me created Mjolnir for the big idiot. I know from quality. And them? Them special. Hey, where's the little turd? He has fallen ill. No. What happened? Aesir? No. The fault is mine. And my responsibility to make it right. Well, we all gotta take responsibility sometime. Huh? Say, what can I do to help? I can do things. What I should tag along? That would no. be really cool if he could. Your work here is enough. All right. So where are you off to in such a hurry? The realm of the dead. Helheim? Shit, this is serious. 
don't okay know. i'm assuming i need to upgrade eye. i guess i don't need to do this but i do maybe I don't know. we'll do this because it gives me extra strength uh i'm not doing it for the actual upgrade of the axe because it doesn't it doesn't matter uh, but yeah okay uh, should I use a resurrection stone? I don't even know if I can use a resurrection stone because the trace isn't with me. I guess I'll use it anyway, but... Huh. Anyway, uh, let's get some skills because I need them, maybe. So. Da -da -da. Melee. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, I can't get that. I've already got that one, I think. Okay. Hello. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I can't get that one. Okay, that's fine. Cool. Let's go to Helheim. I'm wondering if I can remember exactly what it is that I did. Now that Freya's given you the travel room to Helheim, it should be in Helheim. On the table. See, that to me, that rune looked exactly like the rune on Kratos' back. Like the, the thing that holds the Leviathan axe. Uh, Asgard, Bartholheim. Elheim, let's go. Okay, reach the bridge keeper. So yeah, as again, I should point out, I'll probably be skipping multiple chests around here, uh, including if they're even like the Nornir chest, because I do already have everything in my current. Let me take version of the game. Tell you that what you are about to do is absolutely insane. Not Thank you. Odin can survive this cold. So I hope those blades work. They do indeed. Is this the bridge? Go 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 go. No, we're still on the realm travel bridge. We're after the bridge of the Dam. The dead no. use it to cross into their permanent home, the city of Helheim. The bridge keeper who minds admission. He's the one we want. Follow this bridge. It'll lead us straight to him. You know, I really hope never to see this place again. Ooh. Oh, what? I think it's part of that. Oh well. Right. Use the uh, of your blades to burn away that hell's bramble block. I will do. I said I was going to skip these chests, but. I can't remember whether there's anything worth having in here. Light runic attack. I don't think I had that before. Uh, no, sorry. I think that is useful to have, I should say. Because it means I can use it against me. One of the many reasons we went back for those blades. Hello, zombies. Would you like to die, please? Do -do 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 -do. Oh, wait. there is really is someone behind me. Also, uh, something I found out but didn't realize at the time, um, when you get the ability to unlock a switch stance moveset thing, uh, you can't do it while holding up on the, the control stick. And I didn't really understand why, and I think it's because... Your attacks, in theory, move you forward automatically, so you don't necessarily need to hold up on the control pad. But it interrupting your switch stance move was something I didn't get the first time when I was actually just reading through it. 
Only the newly dead should be here. There's too many. The gate must be closed. And if the gate's closed, then it's true. Hell's full up. Without the Valkyrie to sort and cull them, hell is overwhelmed. What? I think I have to go this way. Yeah. I'm for puzzle solving. Alright, there wasn't anything of value down there. Nope, okay, let's go. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Sorry about that. Sneeze on stream. Ah, oh, hello, people. You've come to block my path. I'm going to assume I literally can't just run past them, right? No. Can I? Uh, nope, the game does not... The game does not let you. So as nice as it would be to be able to... Really? I'd like to stop both at the same time. As nice as it would be to skip all these enemies, I have to fight them to get them out of my way. Because otherwise I literally can't do the prompt to climb on the walls. Alright. Now we can start climbing. When we killed the Reavers near my home, they came here. How did they return so quickly? Time doesn't move the same between all realms, especially where the spirit world is concerned. Like the Light of Alfheim? The opposite, in fact. The Lake of Souls feels faster than Alfheim time, but Hell is much slower than Midgard. Sorry, I'm sure that's confusing. If we will be back to my son all the sooner, that is good. Ah, aren't you a quick study? Uh, I kind of forget how I managed to climb across this. Oh, it's left here. Okay, fair enough. There we go. And yeah, this lets you see that there's a Helheim bramble thing blocking a chest on the top. Hmm. Does that give anything useful? No, it doesn't. Yeah, we'll skip that. Da -da -da, da -da -da -da. Do -do 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 -do. Yes, I know, game. But we're skipping it because, in theory, I already have it. Oh, I forgot this happened. Hello! Would you like to die? Really can't stun you anymore, can I? There we go, that's what I wanted. Nice. Oh, he's not dead. Ooh. It's so cool being able to parry projectiles and send them back at them. I love having that upgrade. Valhalla. Is it within hell? Oh, no, no. Valhalla is part of Asgard. Only the worthy dead go there. The warriors who die in glorious combat. Hell is for those who die in dishonor. Criminals. Aye. For those dead of disease, mishap, age. It is dishonorable to grow old. Well... Never too late to go out fighting, I suppose. Yeah, that's always an interesting part of the mythology, isn't it? Is uh, they don't consider being able to grow old honorable, which is really weird. It's like it's almost a Spartan. Um, it's almost a Spartan way of thinking, actually. And hello, Kenshin. Thank you for the same bless you. Uh, how are you doing today? As I mentioned before, this is a weird stream because we're replaying a section of the game that I've already done uh, because the footage expired on Twitch and therefore it I don't was expect lost. it will. Though I don't suppose it will make things any worse either. It'll be one less obstacle for the living to reach the inner sanctum of Helheim. Who'd be mad enough to go there? Me. 
There's lots of people. Get that. Uh, yeah, we're going this way. Uh, they also had a thing where once they grew old enough, they committed the ritual the suicide. The keeper, hmm. Making sure the dead are really dead. What is that he holds? That totem contains a powerful source of magical energy, the very power of Helheim itself. The, the winds of Helheim. Is Just take it and we can leave. How? Start some trouble. You can do that, right? <laughs> 